Good morning. Thank you all for your participation. Several things we'll need to go over before we can proceed. For the best possible outcome, it is imperative that you follow all instructions as they are given. The exterior doors to this facility shall remain locked throughout the duration of the experimentation in order to ensure that there are no distractions. Please place your personal items beneath your seats. This building is secure. The total procedure time for this experiment will be approximately two hours. Please, get comfortable. Participant number one, Rosalie Rodriguez. Follow me. I'm going to ask you a series of questions. Please respond quickly and truthfully. Do you consider yourself a reasonable person? Yes or no? Yeah, I guess so. Of course I'm a reasonable person. Yes or no answers, please. Yes. Would you ever knowingly harm someone? No. No. What? Would you ever knowingly harm someone? What kind of question is that? Again, yes or no answers, please. But whatever, I just want to get this over with, so no. Could you ever kill someone? Look, I can do anything as long as I'm getting paid, okay? Yes or no answers, please. No. No. I repeat, could you ever kill someone? Please, take a seat. Place your right hand next to the machine. Please leave your left hand next to your body. Please stare into the mirror and follow my instructions. Now, turn the center knob until I ask you to stop. Do not stop until I ask you to stop. Please continue. Please continue until I tell you to stop. Go ahead. Turn the knob to the halfway point. Go ahead. Keep going. Please continue. Go ahead. Come on. Turn up all the way. Turn the knob to the halfway mark. No. Put your hand back on the knob and turn it all the way up. Please. <laughs> Do it. What the hell's going on here? Put your hand back on the knob and turn it all the way up. What the hell's going on here? Who's behind that mirror? Sit down and turn the knob! Who's behind the mirror? No. Huh. You're so smart. Don't forget the map. I 
was just a dumb kid with big dreams and my head up in the clouds. My body was always here, but my mind could not be found. Took a rocket trip to see the stars and got lost along the way. About a map and a compass, but there's no north and outer space. There's no north, north and outer space. First love, first kiss, first time I've ever felt such bliss. I've never found out how to take its place. Tumbling round and upside down, just weightlessness, absence of sound. Another episode of Lost in Space. There's no north, north and outer space. Down. I almost burned up in the atmosphere.